Good evening, everybody. Hope everybody had a wonderful Christmas and uh, hope everybody's uh, safe and sound for New Year's Eve and uh, for New Year's uh, tomorrow. And uh, we hope you can join us tomorrow night from six to nine for uh, our first auction of 2021. Let's all hope that 2021 is a lot better than uh, 2020's been. So uh, we're, we're going to be optimistic and say, yep, that's the way it's going to be. So thought I'd give you a real quick uh, preview of what we're going to have uh, tomorrow night. So we'll start off with a couple of lots of build and play toys. And uh, these are uh, made for three and up. So they're real cute. You get have your own little plastic screwdriver, put them together. They have like helicopters and uh, motorcycles, that kind of stuff. So cool stuff. So I think you might like that if there's a little one that uh, you're thinking about. Uh, uh, next lot, uh, lot three would actually be a lot of uh, nautical items. So a couple different size uh, anchor door knockers, really nice uh, candlestick uh, that you'll get to see up close tomorrow night. So several items there in the little nautical set. Uh, We've got some Casio scientific calculators that are really nice. Uh, you are allowed to use those on the uh, SAT and uh, uh, S and the uh, ACT. So those are kind of nice. I see people popping on here, and I'll acknowledge you here. We love you guys. Uh, hi, Virginia. Hi, Greta, Bonnie, and Catherine P. in the house. Thank you so much. So our next lot is actually five of the Madam uh, or... Madame, I don't know which way you should say it, but Madame sounds really fancy. Hi, Mookie. Um, and we have a lot of five of the of the Madame Alexander dolls, which are cool. Uh, we've got a set of, they're called Indian uh, Art Crafts um, Native American doll. Or let's see, it's Indian Art Eskimo uh, craft dolls uh, from Canada that are kind of cool. And then underneath it is one of the uh, International Festival of uh, uh, Toys and Dolls. Uh, it's the Irish version of the Knowles doll, that particular one. Uh, we've got three lots of brooches, a lot of Mark Christmas theme, but there's always next year, right? Um, so we've got some brooches. I've got some uh, Indiana chopper knives uh, for anybody that might be interested in those. And then we've got two monster sets of uh, vintage underwear and these are massive uh both of them are so there's all kinds of different ones in there bally and warners uh you name it it's probably in there so real neat uh, set of those um, uh, we did put out uh, some of the uh can't see them real well there but the jade pendants again in case somebody might be interested in that um We've also got a large lot of uh, decorator items. They're like picture frames, and I'll go through them all. But they're uh, they're I think they're from Hobby Lobby, where all those came from. Uh, got a nice little set of like hunting caps uh, that, that come with warmers. Uh, there's a set of five of those. A couple lots of Bath and Body. Uh, just one lot of cosmetics, um, and we had that in their last auction, but we added to it as well. Uh, a small lot of some uh, kitchen items there, coasters and uh, a canister set uh, with the metal and, and an enamel painted on there. Uh, let's see, and then a lots of big, enormous lots of clothes. So uh, we have small, we have uh, medium, large, extra large, an enormous lot of 2XL. These are all women's. Uh, really nice, uh, tagged. Uh, we'll look, make sure uh, there could be one or you know one here and there that aren't tagged, but they are brand new. Uh, so really nice set of those. Got some men's clothes there, some windbreakers, uh, jogging shorts, well, or I'm sorry, pants. Uh, we'll show you those. There is a lot of women's Cherokee um, socks. A lot of them are cat themed. So if there's somebody that you have that loves cats. We got them. And then uh, there's also some deer fo uh, foam slippers in there. Uh, easy for me to say. Um, and then uh, we've got a couple of uh, souvenirs uh, from England. One is the Charles Dickens uh, candle holder from the Tower of London. And the other is a spode, which a spode to me looks like it's a teacup. Now, I could be wrong, but maybe it's just a real fancy name for that. But that's what I saw. 
And then a real small lot of uh, brass items. Uh, there are hangers. Uh, there's also a, a large, uh, like, clamshell uh, solid brass piece in there. We'll get out tomorrow in case uh, somebody interested in that. And then Mo's got this huge lot of crocheting tools. I mean, it probably weighs about uh, eight or ten pounds. We'll get it all opened up in case uh, somebody's really into that. Oh, my God, it's a huge lot um, of that. And then we'll finish it up. I probably can't see it real well, but it's a real nice two-person hammock. So I actually sold one of those to Danae at one of our early auctions, and then I was going through some of her stuff and found another one. So... That pretty much is a wrap on all that. Hope everyone has a wonderful um, New Year's tonight. Be careful. Uh, be safe. Um, and then rest up for tomorrow night. You can sleep all day tomorrow and just rest up and you can spend the evening with us just playing. But uh, love you guys getting on here. Good to see you. Hey, look, uh, was Punisher on there? I think I might have missed Punisher. I do see Punisher. Hi, Punisher. How you doing? So, Appreciate you all jumping on there while we were giving a little preview. But, uh, oh, I did forget one small thing. We will have our third uh, bid it to win it tomorrow night. So we're waiting to see if somebody's ready to win it for the first time. So you can see the boxes there. We've already picked the winning box. We also know what the prizes are. Very nice. You will not be disappointed. So we love you all, and we look forward to seeing you tomorrow night. Uh, and that does it for Mo and Birdland for tonight. Love y'all. Good night.